Hey guys, so I want to thank you guys so much for 40,000 subscribers. Like, that is crazy. So much. And uh, I just filmed a tutorial on this look. It will be linked in the down bar. It's like a peachy pink with gold. It's really pretty. But anyways, thank you so much. I can't believe that I'm already at 40,000. And if 30,000 was closet tour, 40,000 is bathroom tour. Then what is 50000 going to be? Hmm, let me think about that one. So, I think you guys can figure it out, but let's go look at my bathroom. Okay, so here's my room, and then right here I have like this little hallway in between my room and my bathroom. And then here's my bathroom. So, here's the door to my bathroom, huge as always. I have really big doors. But anyway, let's walk in. I will give you a little overview. Okay, let's close the door. So here's my bathroom. So when you first walk in, I have this really big kind of cupboard type thing. The thing that bothers me about this is that it's not like shiny marble. It's like matte marble. And that bothers me so much because it's not very easy to clean. So I'm going to try to see if I can like, I don't know, make it shiny in any way. On the counter, I have my mirror right here. Hello! Hey guys, so here's my mirror, and there's my camera, Flip Minnow HD. Yeah, okay. So I just have that, and I have a little tissue box, which is actually out of tissues right now, so that's a fail. And this is my light for my like vanity lights, which is those. And this mirror can like move back and forth. This little mirror tray I'm pretty sure I got from Target. And I just have some baby shampoo for when I clean my brushes. I have my contact solution. Some makeup remover. Deodorant. Toothpaste. A little contact thing for when I... Interrupted my filming. I'm so sorry. Would you like um, this? What? Mac and cheese with all different variations. Which one? The SpongeBob, Madagascar, and Finneys and Ferb. I'm gonna put uh, them all together. Okay. What's the difference between these? This, this looks different, right? Um, no, I think they're all the same. But it looks different. Oh. Well, SpongeBob's my favorite, but we can have all of them. They'll all taste the same. Yeah. But SpongeBob's just the most awesome. Okay. <laughs> okay. So anyways, as I was singing, contacts, this is like an extra contact thing, a retainer case, and then all my like toothbrushes, and I have like these little tools for my teeth. Then in here, I usually keep um, like cotton balls, but I'm out right now, so there's nothing in there for the current moment. Here's my sink, and then I have my little electronic dispenser. Um, it's by the brand Lysol, I think, or something, and you just put your hand under it, and then uh, soap comes out. It's just like the ones they have in public restrooms, except a lot nicer, and it smells really good. And then here, I have this little thing. I don't know where I got it, but it, origi it originally came with its own, like, soap and lotion, but I took those out, and I put in my face wash, which is the Clean and Clear Morning Burst Facial Cleanser. This is really good in the morning. It wakes you up. And then I have my favorite lotion, pink grapefruit from the body shop. So I just keep that right there. Then I have another one of these mirrored trays from Target. And this just has all my body splashes and body sprays. That just fell. Okay. So that has all my body splashes. It's very nice. And then in here I have this little box. Chloe, um, I think like my mom's friend made it. But it's empty right now. I will find something to put in it eventually. Here I have this little jewelry box, but up here I just have like tweezers and scissors and stuff for like when I do my eyebrows and a nail clipper. This is like an intense nail clipper. Don't ask why it says plum on it. So then in here I have all my hair ties and ribbons and bows and stuff. And in this one I have clips, bobby pins, stuff like that. So in this 
um, first like cabinet thing, I have hair stuff. This is where I keep all my hair tools and hair products. I still have my like detangler from like five years ago. But anyways, that is all my hair stuff. Then in here, I have uh, lotions and yeah, lotions. This is actually my current favorite lotion. Where is it? But I can't find it anymore. Yeah, it's Bath and Body Works Pink Ray Shirt. Okay, so my sister got it on accident. I asked her to get this one, and she got that one. And then I fell in love with that one. But I have a bunch of these that I have to finish up. So then in this drawer, I have all my nail polishes. I know it's bad to keep them sideways, but I still have not gotten a nail polish rack yet. So if any of you guys know a good website to get a nail polish rack off uh, for a good price, tell me. But I have all my nail polishes. The other day I went to Goodwill, and I got... Eight nail polishes for two dollars each, OPI and SE, and they were unused. Like how amazing! Here I have my blow dryer, some like other hair stuff. I have stretchy headbands and hard headbands, and then in here I have sunglasses. I'm pretty sure, yeah, sunglasses. So that's what's in there. Then in this thing, let's open it up. A bunch of just like under the sink type stuff, I guess you would say. In here, I have, like, I don't know, just the usual stuff. You would have, this is, like, teeth stuff. That's stuff for my contacts down there. And then in here, I have some extra, what are they called? Q-tips and then, like, razor blades. Here, I have a huge thing of Q-tips. Just some, like, ear um, thing for my, like, earrings. I don't know, just, like, all the medicine stuff you would have under your sink, just... Nail polish rivers have uh, all my like bags for toiletries and makeup bags. Okay, then in here I have completely random stuff. So we're just gonna keep that close. And then in here I have towels. Fun, fun. So here's my toilet. On top of my toilet I have like this spray, Egyptian cotton linen spray. And then I have some wipes and you know, a juicy couture box just to make it look nice, I guess. And then I have this little kind of medicine cabinet, I would say. Right here, I keep all my perfumes. And then in here, I don't even know what's in here. In here, I should have toilet paper. I usually keep toilet paper here. So I will put that in. Um, here's my glycerin. Um, my mom gives me, like, all these little containers because... Uh, I like to reuse containers for like DIYs and stuff. I have like an old face wash. These are all old containers that you will probably see me use for DIYs because I like to recycle more old containers. Oh, actually, these are extra soaps. That's what's up there. And then I have like some more little containers and stuff. So that is what's in this cabinet. And then we turn around and here's my laundry bin. And my rugs, I'm pretty sure my mom got them online. Here I just have a window, which I always keep my windows closed, but I open them for the sake of this video. Here I have this little plastic storage unit. I have my lighter because I like to light candles for the bath. And then I have um, just like this little bath kit. So in the first drawer I have um, nail supplies. I have like nail files, uh, cuticle oil, what are these? So just like this I use for French manicure. I have like donning tools, all that fun. Then in the next drawer I have more nail supplies. I have these little nail art wheels that I use to practice tutorials. I have like my nail diamonds. I have my stripers and then some top coats. And here I have all my nail polishes that I don't use very often. Ones that I get like for birthday party, party favors and stuff like that. This is Actually, um, a nail lacquer thinner, so I use it when I have like a gloopy nail polish. So yeah, that's what is in here. I don't really use these often because they're not very good quality, but sometimes I'll find use for those. And in here I have all my bath stuff. I have some Lush things and then just like random bath stuff, you know. Some little soap. Then in here, I have more bath stuff. I have like bath 
body soaps. This is a Britney Spears body wash or something. There's my Neutrogena Wave exfoliating pads, but I can't find my Neutrogena Wave. Then, yeah, just all this stuff. I have some bath salts. Don't do bath salts, kids. But they're not that kind of bath salts. They're different bath salts. <laughs> and then I have all my self-tanning stuff. This is from Sun Labs. It's like a spray. Um, I want to try that. I haven't had a chance to try that out yet, but I will. And if I like it, I will do a review on it for you guys. And then here's just some wheels that go to this plastic storage unit. And here we have my bathtub. I love my bathtub so much. Um, it has this really nice marble that's actually shiny. This one decided not to be shiny, but anyways, this is a nice shiny marble. I have a peach bellini handle going. It's just burning up, burning up, burning up. Okay, and then I have some other candles right here. These two candles I got for like a party favor. They're like the cherry blossom. And then this is a candle too. It's like a sample candle. So that is my bathtub. There's another window, which I always keep close. And then in here is my shower. I have basically what you would have in a shower. I love the little tiles on the floor of my shower. They're really nice. And yeah, all my shampoos, conditioner, products, face wash, you name it, it's in there. So yeah, that is my entire bathroom. That was actually pretty quick, so let's do a really quick spin. I think that was a little too fast. Let's do a slow spin. Okay, I'm getting in the corner. So yeah, that is my bathroom. I hope you guys enjoyed this bathroom tour and I can't wait till I get to 50,000 subscribers and we get the big room tour. Okay, so I'll talk to you guys later. Love you.